If you are trying to play PUBG Battlegrounds and the game keeps freezing or crashing, then keep watching as in this video I'll show you some simple steps you can apply to fix this issue. So we'll jump straight into it and the first thing you need to do is head over to the Steam application and from here just come over to library in the top here and we're going to come down to our list of games in the left and we need to locate PUBG Battlegrounds and we're going to right click and come into manage and select browse local files. Now come inside of the folder TSL game, inside of binaries, win64 and you'll see this tslgame.exe file and we simply need to right click on this file come into properties and inside of the compatibility tab you need to ensure that both disable full screen optimizations and also run this program as administrator are ticked in here and then we can come over to change high dpi settings and you want to check this option down here next to high dpi scaling override and just make sure our application is selected from this list of drop downs and press OK and then apply and OK. Now you also need to do exactly the same with this exec PUBG file. So once again, we're gonna right click, come into properties, head into the compatibility tab and just ensure that these two options are checked. Come over to change high DPI settings and we're gonna check this box at the bottom again, press OK and then apply and OK. You can then close out of this folder and back over to the Steam application. And we're going to right click on PUBG over here, come into properties, and then head over to this installed files tab from the left here and just press verify integrity of game files. And this will scan all of our game files just to ensure that nothing's broken or been corrupted. And if this scan detects any issues, then it will repair it inside of the client here. So once this gets to 100%, you can then close out of this window. And we're then going to come over to our desktop and come to the start menu, search for settings, and head over to the settings tab from the left hand side here you need to come down to windows update and then just press this check for updates button just to ensure you are running the latest version of windows on your computer as sometimes outdated software can cause conflicting issues with our apps and games so once you've ensured that you're fully up to date here we then need to come over to gaming from the left hand side here come over to game mode and what you need to do is try enabling or disabling this game mode here so if you do currently have this enabled like me then i'm going to try disabling this and then launching the game if you already have this disabled then i'd recommend turning this on and once again try launching the game you can then close out of the settings menu and we're going to come over to our start menu and search for device manager and then tap on the device manager tab inside of here we need to come down to display adapters and expand this list and inside of this list you'll need to locate your graphics card that you have installed on your computer so for me it's this amd graphics card here and we need to right click on our graphics card come into update driver and then we can press search automatically for drivers. This should only take a couple of seconds to complete. And as you can see, I'm running the latest driver for my device. So we can close out of this window and close out of here. And the next thing you need to do is come back over to the start menu, search for run, and then tap on the run icon. Inside of here, you need to type in percentage sign temp percentage sign and hit enter. And we're going to select all the folders and files within this folder by pressing control A on your keyboard to select everything and right clicking and pressing the trash icon. If you get the security message pop up, then just press do this for all current items and hit continue. Now there might be a few files and folders left inside here that can't be deleted, which is absolutely fine. We can just close out of this folder and we're gonna come back over to the start menu and search for run again, tap on the run icon. And this time we need to type in just temp without the percentage sign and hit okay. And once again, we're gonna select everything inside of here by pressing control A. And we're going to right click and select the trash icon to delete it. Select do this for all current items and hit continue. And once again, we might be left with a few files and folders in here, which is absolutely fine. You can close out of this window and then we can try launching up the game to see if that's fixed the crashing or freezing issue. Now, if that's still not working, there's a couple of things left to try. And the first one is coming back over to the start menu and searching for Windows security. And then just head over to the Windows security panel and scroll down here till you find device security and select that. And at the top here, you'll see something called core isolation. And we just need to select core isolation details. And we're going to try disabling this memory integrity here by turning it off. And you might get a confirmation message pop up when you try to do this. So just press yes to confirm. And you'll also need to restart your computer for all of these changes to take effect. So I'd recommend restarting your computer now. And once again, checking to see if that's fixed the issue. And then the very last thing we can do is actually try launching up the PUBG Battlegrounds game. And we're just going to try changing a few settings inside of the game itself so once you're inside of the game we just need to head over to our settings in the top right hand side here come over to settings and then head to this graphics tab at the top here and the first thing you need to ensure is that display mode is set to full screen and then we're going to come inside of the advanced tab here and you just need to scroll down and make sure vsync is disabled 
make sure motion blur is also disabled and we can try lowering some of our graphics quality as sometimes if you are running a low-end computer this can be the reason for the game crashing so just try reducing some of these settings down here like shadows and textures and also effects and foliage is another good one to reduce and then we can just press apply and ok to save these changes and that's it guys that's how you fix the issue inside of PUBG where the game's freezing or crashing if this video did help you then please consider dropping a like and subscribing until next time